Doctors in the Netherlands say they've developed another tool to help premature babies in their fight for survival. This artificial womb is meant to replicate the experience of being in utero. It's called aqua womb. So we want to keep the fetal physiology, the fetal circulation, we want to keep it intact so that the baby stays in a, comes into an environment that really mimics the maternal womb. Uh, so that it can develop for a couple more weeks. They say the key to making it work is to prevent the fetus from breathing while being transferred from the uterus to the aqua womb. So then we have attached this transfer bag and we bring in our hand and then we can deliver the child into the transfer bag. Once the baby is inside, we can uh, loosen the transfer bag from the, from the channel. And then we have access to the umbilical cord uh, to connect it to the artificial placenta. Doctors say they have only three minutes to make that connection. Neonatal intensive care is already a high stakes game, but doctors say even a few extra weeks in a womb-like environment can have lifelong benefits for the patient. There's a huge difference if you're being born at 24 weeks or at 28 weeks. When you're being extremely preterm born, we know that young adults being born prematurely, they still face the complications related to the preterm birth. Aqua womb is still in the experimental stage, but with similar experiments going on in North America, the future of neonatal care could be a lot brighter. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Mara Montalbano.